walk into the sunny glades of the forest. Heaven Letter Number 5600 March 25, 2016 To move your life in a direction you want, feel better first. Feeling that you are in a slump, depressed, discouraged, doesn't help you move your life forward. Feeling in a slump tends to keep you where you are. Your feet get caught in quicksand, and you can't move, and so you prep yourself for struggle. The quicksand you are stuck in is the morass of your thoughts. You may say to yourself over and over again, what a terrible situation I am in. If only you could push a button that would take you to feeling better, then better news will arise. So, here again, you have to look at a dismal situation, and look at it differently. Let's say you lost your job. You panic about loss of income, and you allow your sense of worth to flatten itself. You have been dealt an unkind unfair blow. You see an enemy who did not do right by you. Do not make yourself into a victim extraordinaire. Do not believe it. Look at this dire situation differently. You must look at it differently. For instance, you have been dismissed from the company where you work, shoved out, of no use to the company you gave your whole heart to abundantly and loyally. Kicked out. No matter how unjust and how unwarranted, now it is goodbye. So long, you're on your own now. Now you are to get out of the precise small picture and enter a larger arena beyond the boundaries you wrapped your heart and mind in. Arise. Life is telling you that you are to move forward into new territory where another opportunity waits for you. Life does not intend that your being laid off, for instance, is to be a cruel blow. It is more that you are being told to stretch to greater evolution right now. Do not think I believe everything is peachy keen when I tell you that the loss of your job, or death of a beloved, or arrival of divorce or illness is giving you an opportunity. Yes, you are being pointed to change, yet you fear change. You fear the idea that life disrupts you. You had to put in only 10 more years of servitude until retirement. Or, you were so in love with your beloved who was taken away from you. Or, you were in excellent health, and now, you may insist that none of this that you see as adversity was supposed to happen. You have been desiring life to stay as it was. That's all you ask. Yet, dear ones, it was too much to ask. Take a new approach. Instead of being stuck in the form life was, now you are going somewhere. You are on an adventure. You are looking for something. You are going to find it. Instead of being frozen in time, you move forward. What is next for you? It is unknown. You may feel that your safety net is in shreds. Look at it this way. You are going into the forest, and you will discover what is waiting for you. You are going to do something wonderful. The time will come when you are glad you were pushed to go into the forest where a treasure awaits you. If you didn't go into the forest, how would you find the treasure and come closer to yourself? Instead, you may have been seeing only doom before you. You tied up your own hands and felt helpless. Who undermines you, dear ones? You. Only you. Be someone who attracts a happier job or finds yourself starting a business and succeeding very well. Without this push, you might never have gone this route. Gather happiness into you. A dark force has glades. Walk into the glades. Channeled by Gloria Wendroff. HeavenLetters.org